we're moving. We're at Home Depot and I'm looking for some boxes, packing tape, and bubble wrap. give a little bit of an intro to this video yes it's a moving vlog but it is a very intense moving vlog basically i am moving out of my first college apartment it's been a interesting couple months here but i am finally moving out i am actually going to be moving in with my friend and her roommate at her apartment one of her roommates just graduated and is moving out so she offered me her spot and it kind of just seemed like the perfect fit so i am moving out of this apartment it has served me well but I'm ready. I'm ready for the new chapter ahead. My new apartment. It is so cute. I can't wait to show you guys. I have to be moved out of this apartment by 21st. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six. Six days to move out. Earlier today, I went to Home Depot to get a couple more boxes, some bubble wrap and tape. I honestly need to stop talking and get to packing some boxes. <laughs> Okay, so here's kind of the current state of my room. I'm thinking that all the jackets on my clothing rack are gonna go in this extra large box, and then I still have some jackets hung up here, and then I'll probably squish my sweatshirts in there as well. Welcome to my closet. She's had better days, I will say. Looking at it right now, after just packing all of my jackets and stuff, I definitely have some stuff that I don't wear anymore. Yeah, I've come to that conclusion. So I think I'm going to decongest the stuff that I have and know what I'm taking with me to my new place and know what I'm honestly gonna give away or give to one of my friends or something. But it's like I don't wear it. Mm, but it's cute. No, 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 no. We're not gonna hold on to things. I have to let it go. Of the construction outside. I don't think I've actually lived a day in this apartment where there wasn't construction outside. Like that's definitely one of the reasons why I'm moving as well. I started this clip because I wanted to give a little update. It's about 2 10 p.m. right now and I'm honestly exhausted from the boxes that I have packed. Let's just invite you guys into my brain right now so you guys know what I'm thinking. So I packed my shoes, I packed my jackets and sweatshirts. All that's in my closet right now is just like my everyday clothes. But I'm thinking about doing that very last because until I move my mattress into my new apartment, I'm gonna be living here. So I still need like my clothes to be able to change and everything. So that's why I'm deciding on packing that last. I still have so much to pack. I have to do my bathroom and I have to pack like my plates and my cups and stuff, but I'm still using that at the moment. So I'm just not exactly sure when the right time to pack those away. But I'm thinking about just going to the apartment, taking some stuff right now, lighten the load and then finishing up tomorrow because your girl is exhausted and it's only been like four hours. 
I will not be missing this. woke up at 11 11 today which is like okay cool but it's like i'm behind schedule i didn't end up going to drop off some things yesterday like i should have i just thought why not just make it a one time trip like today's packing day and then today's like, moving day the majority of everything i need to do is happening today i need to pack up my clothes so fold and pack them up i need to clean up my bathroom and pack all of the stuff in there i still need to pack my dishes and like tupperware and then my bed that's the fourth thing my bed when i first moved into this apartment i had to buy a new bed so it was so easy like they shipped it it was a memory foam like it opened up but now i have to move a full mattress I love how I just threw away the instructions and thought I could do this myself. So it says, place mattress inside vacuum bag. Okay, seal the bag. Please make sure that the white color of the zipper is fully inserted into the black color of the zipper to ensure a full seal. The white color of the zipper. Oh, okay, got you, got you. Put circular vacuum hose on the valve. Vacuum the mattress. Close valve, roll the mattress. <laughs> but it's not that easy. But maybe it is. It actually has gotten so small. I'm so surprised that this is working so well. I packed all of my clothes, so as you can see, my closet is basically almost empty. I just have to pack like my t-shirts along here. I usually fold my stuff, but I just decided to lay them flat since those are the clothes I usually have hung up and I didn't want it to get like all wrinkly and stuff. And it honestly fit. I'm just gonna try zipping it up right now. literally looking up a task grabber right now because I don't think I can do this thing on my own. Don't have family in San Diego and I'm just like, I, I don't think I can do this alone. I don't think so. As much as I don't need help, I need help. I did the packing part, but the, the actual lifting and the moving, I can't do that. I moved the mattress all by myself. I'm actually so proud. It's actually not that heavy. I mean it is, but the elevator had to give some props. I'm in my new room! Yay! I'm actually so happy! None of my roommates are home right now, but I'll show you guys my room. Let me give you guys a quick little room tour. So here's my room. I have amazing lighting coming in from this window, my closet, 
white walls and then she actually left her desk in this chair so that's why i really want to sell my desk and then she also left this dresser for me and this lamp oh my gosh i'm so happy my room and it's white and uh, don't even know how happy these white walls just make me i don't know i'm just so happy i'm just so 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 happy and so grateful maybe right now i'll show you guys a little bit of the apartment it's just it's too cute easy to move the mattress moving this mattress was literally my biggest fear but it literally just expanded so quickly and it probably needs a little bit more time to get as fluffy as it was but i could literally sleep on this thing it's really comfortable i'm so happy oh my gosh okay and now to finish moving everything else i'm literally sweating like crazy <laughs> So this is what it's looking like right now. I packed up like my Tupperware, my plates, my cups. I actually had to just use a t-shirt and like an old jacket to pack up my plates and stuff because I did not have bubble wrap to do that. Um, so hopefully all of that is fine. And at the very bottom, I put like pillows that I don't use anymore. So since I'm not really moving that far, um, I'm just gonna hope that this is fine with all the dishes in there. Um, and here I packed up like my toaster ovens at the bottom, my pots and pans, my sheet pans, um, cutting boards, utensils, all of that's in there. In these bags over here, I packed up what was left in my pantry and then my spices in here, medicine cabinet. So basically, this is everything that I need to take over to the new place. I still have my fingers crossed that I'll sell this desk before I have to move, but I might need to take it with me. I had to take apart my chair, so I'm gonna pack that with me. And then these two huge items I still need to deal with. I need to take this apart. Um, I just brought out my tool kit, so I need to take um, this whole bed frame apart. And then I need to bubble wrap these two mirrors over here. But that is pretty much it. I'm still waiting for my sister to come to lift like the heavier things. I feel like that's what's making this moving process slow, is that I can't lift everything by myself. But she's going to help me move everything, um, the heavy stuff tomorrow. But I'm going to at least have everything prepared, like bubble wrapping the mirror, having this taken apart so it's easier to move when she is um, available to help me. And then start hopefully unpacking like my clothes and stuff and just feel a little bit more organized in one place because I have been coming back and forth so yeah hopefully by tomorrow I'll feel a bit more at home and in place um, without going back and forth This room is definitely a work in progress right now. Um, I feel still slightly like a mess, but I think once I unpack my clothes, I can get some boxes out of here and it'll feel a little less cluttered. So yeah, I'm just gonna hang up my clothes and get a bit more organized. Mm -hmm. 